Greetings, 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 my people. Welcome once again to my channel. My name is Biwa Ricky Kumstaka NZ. This channel aims to inform you and also to showcase to you the best of the best high quality, high premium, silver collectible, silver bullion coins, past, present, future coins struck by means from all over the world. So please do kindly consider supporting my effort and also acknowledging my hard work by hitting that subscribe button. In this update edition following from the last update edition that I did with regards to um, the werewolf, uh, the Fafnir werewolf for Germania Mint, we are also looking at another coin struck by the Germania Mint. They have been excellent this year with their releases and with their products. So we are looking at a two ounce version, which is actually way different from the one ounce version that you've seen the the dealers already selling at the moment. Um, this is the 2021 Malta two ounce night of the past. So this is a high relief coin. It is antique. It is selectively gilded. So it is um, a super super high relief coin and indeed it's a super high premium coin it won't be cheap as you will see as i go into the details of this coin however um, i will be playing a very short clip for you a very short clip which is courtesy of none other than germania mint themselves so it's um, a very short clip that the germania mint has uh, made which is actually detailing all angles of the coin showcasing the crest crispy finish of this coin which i will explain um in the in the following um stages and without further ado let me um send you guys to the or let me actually um bring in the clip for you guys so stay tuned and let's dive into the video clip Alright, I'm sure you enjoyed that wonderful video clip from the Germania Mint. It was really, really fantastic um, video from them showing um, all the angles of the coin and showing the, um, the, the, the finish of the coin. Um, this is the, the obverse of the coin. It is not the reverse, it is the obverse. Um, I know it's a bit strange for them to have this as as the obverse because we normally expect the obverse to be where you have the coat of arms or where you have the effigy of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth but this is the reverse if so for the Germania mint um, coins and rounds it is the opposite so um, yes this is the reverse of the coin and this is the obverse itself and um, going into the details of the coin i want to 
I want to pause this video for just a second to appeal to each and every one of you watching to please um, hit that like button. I know that many people do watch this um, particular YouTube channel, but you guys don't really um, smash that like button. It does help um, the YouTube algorithm to help th this channel by actually recommending it to to more people so if you hit the like button you are helping me out the youtube algorithm will bless and sanctify this particular um, update edition and it recommends it to more people so i would appeal please kindly hit the like button thank you very much and let's um let's go into the details of the of the coin itself um having a brief read it's saying that knights of of the past is the first commemorative coin created through close cooperation between the central bank of Malta and Germania Mint. This issue will start a series of unique bullion coins which in a modern way refer to the traditions of the order of Malta. Malta I believe is, is an Eastern European um, country, I think closer to Moldova, Greece, Hungary. Poland, I believe. Anyways, let's get on with the description. The collection will be the result of a collaboration combining superior minting and precious metals quality with the artistic vision, marketing and distribution of both institutions. The obverse of the first coin of the series depicts the Knights of Malta in a battle array with the famous Verdel Palace in the background. So this is what they mean about the Knights charging for their fight and the palace is just in the background. Okay, um, where did I stop? The reverse of the coin presents the Order's coat of arms on a shield held by Maltese knight. This is it. It's a beautiful coat of arms, one of the most beautiful that I've seen so far. Um, <coughs> for this special issue of the Knights of the Past, now struck in high relief, the mint has also applied discreet finishes of gold palladium and ruthenium to both sides of the coin wow 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 what a wow this is complete finishing this is finish on top of finish on top of finish this is mega finish well i believe if you've seen the video you would have seen how crips and how glittery and shiny the the coin was as they showed the side angle of the of the coin yeah so they really meant business this time around um the germania mean to actually produce something that is really of high and extreme high quality and yes indeed i will be in no doubt to to see um how this coin will look in in the real life um hopefully i do have enough budget and hopefully um you guys have budgeted enough dry powder to fire on this on this coin it won't be cheap but let's see how we go let me proceed further to the specifications um looking at the highlights of the coin it said that it contains two ounces of four nine silver which is good it's not um a three nines fine is a four nines fine um limited mintage of 999 pieces so it is um extremely low <coughs> at capped at 1999 almost a thousand um it's a legal tender of malta because it's the um, government of malta that is actually um authorizing the production of this um coin in collaboration with um germania mint um it's a 10 euro denomination legal tender so it is a coin not a round regardless whether the effigy of her majesty is there or not it is a coin it is a legal tender of malta anyways going to the specifications um we see that is a two troy ounce of silver the quality is high relief purity we've covered it it's a four nine fine we know the denomination as 10 euros the diameter is 45 that's a massive large diameter 
that is very wide um courtesy of um smart meeting technology that i have um covered in my video if you haven't seen that you need to watch that video it is long but it has loads of information so they said here it comes with um, mint capsule thematic blister pack certificate of authenticity yeah that is it for this coin i believe there is a one ounce version of it and this is what it looks like the one ounce version it's a five euro denomination um i didn't bother to get this particular coin because i was well aware from the start that this coin was coming out so i had to to play the waiting game and probably um gamble and um do the waiting game and see um when and how this coin is going to be received same way um Red Bull gambled this morning um, against Mercedes to win the title. So that's the same way I, I have gambled with regards to the one ounce coin. Um, getting rid of the one ounce coin, um, not having any interest in it, and focusing solely on this um, on this particular two ounce coin because i believe it it will be mostly desirable with the low mintage and looking at the price of the one ounce it is a bit expensive for a one ounce coin so i said it's better for me to probably um shoot my shot um gamble along and um try to get the the two ounce probably um we reserve the money for the one ounce and probably go all in on the two ounce and see if my gamble will pay off all right um this is the obverse yeah there is a little bit of a difference with the one ounce and the and the two ounce if you've noticed the difference just slight difference to where the gilded sword is going through the middle as opposed to where this one is closer to the edge of the coin at least that's what i can pick out from the differences i don't have the coins hand in hand um yeah this is the reverse itself stunning stunning design um hopefully i'm able to get the two ounce god willing um hopefully and yeah it comes in this in this packaging but in the video you've already seen the packaging for the two ounce which is much more sophisticated um it comes with certificate of authenticity so um for those of you that have watched my bu versus numismatic smart minting technology um coins or the difference between my the difference between um bu versus the numismatics um coins you will see that um, i've graded them into categories so i will be expecting this coin to be in the extra high bullion grade because of its um it's uh mintage it's mintage it's around fifteen thousand and with regards to the finish and the way it's been presented so it's um a bullion uncirculated coin but i have graded it at an extra high um bullion grade coin um it is a fine and fines according to the highlights mintage fifteen thousand, which is similar to your big five um series from the south african mint legal tender five euros brilliant uncirculated sorry not bullion uncirculated is brilliant uncirculated bu um one ounce one troy ounce four nines fines five euros germania mint fifteen thousand mintage 38.6 uh, millimeters in diameter 0.61 millimeters in diameters <sighs> all right um <coughs> I believe um, that is all I have for you with regards to this update information. Let me know in the comment section below if um, if you will be getting this coin, this particular coin. Um, 
and I also want to hear from you what you think about this particular um, night of the past that they've um, done or the modifications that they've done to this coin. Anyways, if you have enjoyed the information that you have re received um, this evening, um, yes, it's evening in New Zealand, almost um, eight o'clock. Yeah, I'm getting tired back from work. So if you've um, enjoyed what you've um, seen this evening, um, kindly um, like as I've already appealed. And um, if you're new to the channel, if this is your first time watching this update, um, Kindly go through all the um, all the videos or some of the videos um, that might interest you in the channel and make up your mind to subscribe. I bring you um, the best of the best updates. And um, yes, thank you very much. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Thank you.